Okay, welcome back to another YouTube video. It is your girl in the way and there's absolutely no way without going through the way and we believe that Jesus Christ is the way. And we are just going to jump straight into day number. See, I've even forgotten the days. Like, shooting things in advance is really stressful. <laughs> like, at the same time, I need to do it because I do not have time during the week anymore. So, yeah, I think we're in day 10. Yes, we're in day 10. Yes, yes, we are in day 10. And I was going to open the scripture before we started. Today has just been a really difficult day for me. Um, and I think that's why that's really been a really difficult um, day. A lot just, you know, it's not adding up in my heart, in my mind. You know, it's just lamentating to the Lord. Uh, John 14, verse 6. Just lamentating to the Lord, like I honestly struggled with today, and I'm not even gonna lie about it. <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna record anyway because you know the will of the Father is not always easy, but it must be done. <laughs> Someone must do it, right? Okay, so let's record. It is day 10, and we are just gonna jump straight into how love does not delight in evil but delights in truth i mean it's obvious that love does love is not evil i mean that's like very obvious and what i love about the word of god that is that it always assumes that we don't know what is what it always assumes that we have no idea what's going on so it tells us every single thing to the t listen love does not you know delight in evil but delights in truth and some versions say rejoice instead of delight but they both mean the same thing of dwell in joy into something when you delight in something you meditate on it daily you speak about it you nurture it right and the lord really like led me to read um john 14 verse 6 when it came to this specific um devotional which reads that Jesus answered I am the way and the truth and the life no one comes to the Father except through me and what I love about the scripture is that it summarizes nicely who Jesus is in our lives like straight to the point when it says he is the truth it means wherever there is Jesus there is absolute truth and therefore there is delight. Truth can also be seen as integrity and not lying. And what I love about the truth is that it is the word of God. Like there's further scriptures that speak about our putting on our belt of truth to cover us up, right? And just that in itself speaks about the truth of God that comes with his word. And it comes with integrity. Like truth is so many things, but <laughs> it's very um, nice to look at it from the perspective of that truth is who God says he is and what he can be in our lives and when you delight in love or love love delights in truth it means that you delight in the word of God and there's various scriptures in Psalms that speak about how we should be delighting in the Lord we must delight in the Lord there's a song by Plan Shakers like called delight in the Lord I love that song so much because like it's just it summarizes the joy of serving and being in the presence of God and just spending time with God it really changes your whole mood and I say this from a person that like I shared today today was a very difficult day for me um, and just getting to the point where I was like let me pick up my Bible, let me read the Word of God, let me get in this devotional, let me understand what love is, let me comprehend what it means to be a child of God all over again. Just that constant reminder and meditating on the Word of God really shifted my mood because I don't want to do anything today. Um, I'm getting emotional because I don't even want to record today. Uh, I didn't want to do absolutely anything. I woke up and I was tired and I just told God that, listen, it's just, yeah, it was really, very really difficult. And I think I do understand that I later in the day recognized the spiritual warfare that was plaguing on my heart and why I was so heavily. It's quite interesting that even during the state of I, of doing nothing, like my heart was just like, win souls for Jesus. <laughs> like I was out in the kitchen, like telling people about God, testifying. I don't know how many times I testified today. I spoke to one lady um, like it's just so many people I testified to today and 
I love how God does things and even though and like he gave me a revelation today that my most honest prayer has always been God your your, your will hurts um, it's really difficult there's so many things that I cannot discuss on camera like about my life that are going on that are making me get to the state where the enemy is utilizing my own experiences to attack me but I know he's lying so here I am recording <laughs> because why not obedience is more important than the devil Psh, come on somebody um, so yeah I hope you guys enjoy today's devotional and I hope that you take delight in the Lord because the joy of the Lord is our strength even in like the midst of all of this like I shared the joy of the Lord was my strength like I had to pull on the weight of God and really trust in God and step out in faith and here I am recording today I'm gonna record like three or four today um, but yeah this is the first one of the rest of the four but I hope that it encouraged you and I hope that my spirits will be a lot more high in the next one but yeah thanks for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you in the next youtube video or i'll see you tomorrow bye, -bye.